Hello. <laughs> we gotta go find a dock cart because we gotta get some stuff cleaned up off the boat today. And we've also got to get something out of the truck, something that's kind of cool. We're gonna open it up and test it out. Yesterday, this girl here. It was here, my birthday and I turned 12. <laughs> yep, 12, almost a teenager. Yes. So, so, I have uh, one more year. She only asked for one thing for her birthday. And it was kind of expensive, so I didn't ask for anything else. So, we're gonna show Is there a dock card up there? There's one over there. There's a dock card over here, okay. Let's go get one. Do you think it's safe to walk through the parking lot with it? That's probably easier than going crazy. down the ramp and up the ramp and down the ramp. You're carrying this on the way back. Okay. Yep, flip that. That guy right there, we gotta get that one. And these boxes here from Defender, these are very important. This is a project that we're gonna be working on in a few weeks. Definitely not today. All right, got it. To the boat, let's get it unpacked so we can show everybody what it is. So yesterday we had a monsoon of rain. This is usually like a wood deck, but all of this dirt and things, there was so much water that it just washed down into here. I don't like being here because you can't see the boat, you know? It's getting windy and I'm worried about the fish. So we just ran out to get pizza, and now we've got a severe thunderstorm with penny-sized hail, so we quickly drove up to the road to try to get underneath this tree canopy. I don't know if you can see it, but the hail is still, holy moly. Oh my God. Make this tree right to fall. There's flooding everywhere. What in the world? Oh my gosh, this is crazy. It seems like the hail may have stopped. Oh, you just hit one of those branches. I think the hail may have stopped. We have a paddle board, and it had really, really good reviews online, and all the reviews were true. I know that for a fact. It's very stable, absolutely beautiful, and on, I'm trying. To, I'm, I'm focused right now. We'll put a link in the video description to our Amazon store, which will have these paddle boards. But so far, mm -hmm. we're really pleased with the quality. You want to do it? Yeah. Okay. Over. I don't want to break the fin off. Yeah, that would be really bad. And then we're just going to give it a toss here like this. Beautiful. So the big houseboat that was right behind us, right here, just took off. They loaded up a whole bunch of people and they went out for a day on the water. So we've got all of this room for the kids to practice paddle boarding. And I think what we'll do oh, is, <laughs> you're practicing right now? I think what we'll do is they'll go here and they'll go out over here and then they'll go back up into here because there's almost no boat traffic up in there. And um, when we do see alligators, they're usually not up in there. But when we see the alligators, they're also very little. And I they're don't think that scared they're scared of humans. And them. that's right. So see of marshmallows. The, the, a while ago, over here, where you might be able to pick out, there's like a boat um, missing somewhere in there. I'm not sure where, but I don't think they're here anymore. Oh, this catamaran's going out. 
anyway, someone would stand out on the on the bow of the boat and throw marshmallows at the gator, and now um, they come pretty close to people, which is not good. And you know what? I don't know. I don't know if this will make it into the final edit of this video, but I, one of them came really close to us here on the boat, and it's little. It's not a danger to me, but it, 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 Ella thinks it's tracking us, but I don't think so. Like if I went to the end of the boat, it would follow me there. If I went back, it would follow me there. If Lexi went to the end of the boat, it would follow her there. I tried to spray it with the hose to see if maybe I could scare it away, and it did not care about the hose at all. It actually came closer. So before anyone goes to the keyboard right now and starts saying that I'm, you know, abusing animals or whatnot, I'm actually trying to help it because if it's comfortable with people and it keeps coming up um, to people, then it's going to be declared a nuisance and they're going to kill it. And we certainly don't want that. Um, and I didn't see this, but I heard that someone else in the marina um, it got so close that they whacked it with a stick or an oar or something like that. And honestly, that's probably the best thing because then it will become scared of people and it'll stay away. We are so ready to take our boat out and um, hopefully in a week or so we'll get it out again. So if people are feeding it this year, the only problem would be if it, if it came up to the paddle board like, hello, I want food. That would be a problem. I would whack it. Whack it with the oar. I would whack it and I would be freaking out. If a gator comes up to you while on the paddle board, whack it's it with right an oar. And, and I look down and it's like right there. It's like, oh, whack it. <laughs> whack it. Show me again how you would whack it. There you go. say thanks to everybody who took time out of their day to send me happy birthday messages on Facebook. I read every single last one of them. There was a lot to read. Yeah, I really appreciate that. That was very kind of you. <laughs> I'd like to take a moment to thank our newest patron, Mr. Tom Brown. Thank you so much for joining the crew. We have definitely got some good momentum going on Patreon. And if you're interested in supporting our channel and helping us to get out there on the water, then give Patreon a look. Memberships start at $3. Soon we're going to have a lot of extra content up there as our channel gets into full swing. So I'm excited to share that and we've got a lot of great ideas. If you joined our channel because you're interested in the boat refit and our kind of non-traditional approach to things, then don't don't worry, we have a lot of boat refit stuff coming, but uh, we definitely want to lace in some family type stuff as well. So if you forgot to send me a birthday wish, it's fine. You can easily make it up to me by just hitting that subscribe button down below. Maybe hit that like button too. <laughs> okay, I want to go paddleboard now. <laughs> It is turning out to be a beautiful evening. 